Okay, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to um, share a Google Doc with your students so each of them have their own copy to work on. So I'm in Google Classroom and I'm going to click on the class that I want to create an assignment to. You'll remember down here the plus icon is where we can add assignments and questions. So I'm going to click on the plus icon and create an assignment. This is my sample assignment. I spelled it wrong, but that's okay for now. I'm going to add um, a document from Google Drive, and how I did that is I'm going to attach down here from Google Drive, and I'm going to find the handout that I want to attach. So here's my handout, and when I press Add, I have a couple options. And you have to do this before you assign the assignment. If you click the Assign button, this option will go away so make sure you get it right the first time. When I click on students can view file, students can view file means that students will each get a copy of the file. They can't edit it, they can only look at it or print it out. Students can edit file, that means that all 30 of your students will be working on the same document at the same time and that's probably not what you want right now. Make a copy for each student. This is what I really like about Google Drive. This means that each student will get their own copy of this Google Doc, their own version of it, and when they edit it, only their changes will be seen. So it's not 30 people working on the same thing, it's each get their own. So just to review how I got that, I went to the plus sign, I did create assignment. This is when I'm doing my sample assignment. I'm going to call this, uh, like we talked about, this is my number 003, that's how we're going to label our assignments. I'm going to create and attach a new Google Doc. And after I attach it, I'm going to make sure over here that the students can make a copy, excuse me, make a copy for each student. Now I'm ready to assign. And now when it comes up in the classroom stream, you'll see that on the teacher view, each student's going to get a copy. If for some reason I forgot to do that, I'm going to need to delete my assignment and then create it again. Okay, let me know if you have any questions.